Hey guys, what's up? Lord Mitra again here, your lord of video games, and welcome to another episode of Tales of Vesperia Definitive Edition. In the last episode, we arrived here in the ghost ship, and we started going along and reached this spot here. So, we fought a boss battle, and we actually did another secret mission. And we got this. It looks like the case holding the clear CL crystal just won't open. I wish we could make sure it's actually in there, considering the sort of place we found it in. Couldn't you just bust it open with your magic? Not no, good. I can't. Right. If we damaged the contents, we wouldn't be able to make the delivery. No, I mean, I already tried blowing it up. This little box is uh, tougher than it looks. Rita? I... I'm at a loss for words. <sighs> Get it, Estelle. There's not much you can say to that. Uh, anyway, I suppose it makes sense to put something so important in an unbreakable box. Yeah. All right, let's go up. Should be the way out. Oh, we get a chest. Of course, a fight. All right, what's in here? Holy symbol. Okay, she restores 3% of max HP. That's actually pretty good. Oh, we can keep climbing. Let me, before I forget, now that I have Patty in the party, might as well do it ever, after every single fight. Because we could get a recipe from her. So hopefully we can get it. Oh, oh my God. It's going to tell me to keep climbing. Are you kidding me? Sage. It's the way. Okay. So this is not the way out. It's just the way to for more chests, but I'm glad I went this way because I would have missed this. 10,000 gald. Nice. I wish like they would jump down or just like slide. That would actually, you know, take a lot less time. All right, back to town. Okay, there we go. And now let's head back down. And I guess the other way we can distort, right? Huh? Wasn't this locked earlier? I guess we can go back through here. Oh, I guess I didn't check this. Mm, the curse was broken, huh? Don't be ridiculous. Now let's go. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Oh my god. Where this this has to lead off to the where the stern is, right? Yep. What was that skeleton monster? It wasn't the sort of thing we regularly encounter. It could be a creature possessed by spirits that wanders the Atherum. <laughs> that can't possibly be it. It's too unscientific. Do you sense anything amiss, Repeat? <laughs> What'd he say? I um I don't know. <laughs> Looks like That's Yuri. Yuri to interpret for us. Hey, Yuri! Hold on. There's no need to investigate this right now, is there? Hmm. Should we have finished it off when we had the chance? No. Calm it down, guys. Jeez. Uh, what'd I step onto? If we could just jump down from here, we'd reach the ship in no time. Here. Oh. Um, where did you get that? I thought something like this might happen. So I brought this from inside the ship. Oh my god, Judith. I think I'm gonna gag. All right. Let's go back to the ship. Oh! Good grief. If the Ceres Blasty has been fixed, that means we can say sayonara this hellhole. Yep. All right. Good. Okay, good. There was no other way. All right. And now from here, uh, where, uh, I guess I just have to follow the path. Now there has to be one here, right? Oh, yes, there is. Okay. I was like, there's no way they make me go through all that. 
Oh, we make another ladder here. Perfect. Like, this spot is very suspicious. All right, we can go back to the ship. Please don't see me. Please don't see me. Please don't see me. It saw me. You know what? I'm going to make an example out of you. Ow. If I can, like, you know, hit them. There we go. All right. Come here, you. Stop running. So annoying because they run all over. Ow, ow. There we go. Why am I? No, not that way. There we go. Link slash member taunt. That's a lot of skills. All right, back to the ship we go. Has been fixed. Perfect. So it seems. Woo. Thank goodness. Of all the... Why do I always get sucked into these messes? Mm -hmm. If it was anybody other than me, you guys would have been left behind. Okay. Sorry about that. We'll never do it again. Promise. <sighs> I wonder what caused the Saras Blastia to break down. That's a good question. It just started working again. I don't have the slightest clue why. Hmm. You really think there's a curse then? Raven. Perhaps the captain wanted to pass the clear seal crystal on to someone and reached out to us. No way. Dead people can't want to do anything. Doors there get will. stuck. The Saras Blastia stops working. Sounds like a curse to me. The world's a big place. There are many things we humans don't understand. I said it can't happen, so it just can't. Oh, poor Carl. He hasn't even spoken. What are you hitting me for? So, how do you like it? Well, the boss here has seen better days. Mm -hmm. hmm. What's the matter? We don't know why it broke down, but either way, it's barely holding together. If we keep using this old piece of junk Blastia, we're guaranteed a shipwreck in the middle of the sea. Oh, damn. Wow, so she's sensible when it comes to ships. What? She is? What are you all looking at? Fine, fine. As soon as we get to port, I'm getting you a new one. Thank you. You don't have a problem with that, do you? Seriously, this is a crazy deal you're getting. Hey, are we going to Nordopolica or not? Let's get this thing out of here. Calm down. Right. I'm looking forward to finally getting there as well. Rita earned the anti-nonsense title. I agree with you, girl. I agree with you there. Is the fog lifted? The fog has been lifted. Oh, wow. It's still... All right. Uh... Wow. I love how I came all this way. We're going back to Capwanor because there are quests here. It's raining again. Why is it raining again? I don't understand it. It's just that spot. All right. Which one was Capwanor? This one. All right. Let's go. Yes, you give me something. Are you staying the night? We just got to catch us some delicious fatty fishing today. You should definitely stay at our inn and experience our delicious seafood rice bowl. Ooh. <laughs> that sounds mighty tasty. Do you like seafood rice bowls, young man? Sure, I guess. Well then, this is for you. A recipe? It's a recipe for seafood rice bowl. Mm-hmm. Amazing. This harmony of sea and land is one whale of a feast. You really pulled out all the stops at this dish. Learn this recipe for a seafood bowl. Okay. My grandson's favorite food, you see. He's working in the Imperial Knights right now, so I don't get to see him very much. He's right around the same age as you, young man. I should give my grandson a taste of his grandma's hope cooking, which I'm sure he's missing. 
Oh, I'm sorry. I must sound so selfish. But please, take it if you'd like. Night around the same age as Yuri. He said... He said his family lived in Capua Nord, didn't he? Uh, is your grandson's name Shet? How did you know that? I used to be a knight myself. I trained with Hachette. Well, well. I have a message from him, actually. He told me to tell you that he's doing well in Heliord. Yes, I'm sure he's working hard for the knights. I'm glad. Thank you for telling me that. I must give you something for your thoughtfulness. No, you've given us all enough already. We'll definitely use your recipe. Thank you. Uh, why are you here? It's my cue. Don't be hasty. The recipe for my transcendent rest seafood rice bowl, the holy grail of cooking, is right here. And now, it is yours. Time to set sail. <laughs> Good call. But where are you going? You must take my recipe for transcendent... Transcendent Seafood Rice Bowl. It is the end product of my cruelly and relentless research. No. I've had enough. <sighs> right. Oh. Morph. What is it, repeat? What kind of Blastia are you selling? Well, it's smallest Blastia. You regret if you don't buy it. Oh, really? So where are you keeping this treasure? Over in that office. Hold on. I require, I require an advance payment of 500,000 gold, first and foremost. 500,000 gold? <sighs> I, the great Mordio, Aspio's best and brightest mage, guarantee its quality. So come on, how about it? Oh, you're the... Harab man going around claiming to be me? I've heard this before. Yeah, well, we found him. We can't just feign ignorance, huh? <laughs> Wait a moment. Could that man be the court thief? Hey, Denteki, wasn't it? Yep. Huh? Who's asking? Fancy meeting you here, Mr. Court Thief. Yo, I remember you. I'm sure you remember what you did, too. The little quarters in chaos because of you. Ah, I'm sorry. I didn't have a choice. I was just doing what I was ordered. I don't care if you were following orders or not. It doesn't change what you did. Ah, I beg you, forgive me. Like, that'll make me forgive and forget like it's no big deal. You're going to pay ounce for ounce for all the trouble you cost. Damn it. I never should have gotten involved in the shady stuff Barbos was up to. I only put up with pretending to be that weirdo mage because he said it'd be make everything go smoothly too. Not that bull about being Ospio's best and brightest mage. Who cares? It just makes them a blasty nut. <laughs> um. I wish I'd never heard that stupid freak's name to begin with. Hmm. You have some nerve. But why? Seeing a person's name and using it to sell fake Blastia. And then calling them a weirdo on top of everything else. Eee! Help me! Stone Blast. Ah! <sighs> I feel better now. That, that might have been a bit much, Rita. If we would have just kept his mouth shut. What the heck? I want to be the one to do that. Man, how are you guys? I never would have known he was scamming me. Just be more careful from now on. It sounds too good to be true. It probably is. Yeah, absolutely. You can leave this con to me. Tell the knights about him, so we'll never be able to do this again. Oh my god. Well, he'll be rotting inside a jail cell for a while. He can rot in there for all his life, for all I care. 
I suppose this means we can put this core thief incident behind us at last. Finally, we wrap this up. It's too bad you didn't get to beat him up yourself, Yuri. Well, Rita took care of it better than I could have. Calling it good. Right, Rapine? Morph! Right now that I'm here, let's buy. Mm, nothing of this, obviously. The food, because I need, like, fresh sandwiches. Because some of this stuff you can only get in certain spots. There we go. Alright, let's go to Nordopolica then. Where the hell is Nordopolica? Oh, that might be it over there. Hopefully this is it. Oh, I guess so. So there's Nordopolica. Yep, otherwise known as the Colosseum City. Once popular among the nobility is a place for pitting criminals against each other in brutal contest. Nordopolica is currently run by the Guild Palestrale and has become a city of entertainment. Hmm. Yeah, Palestrale's just as big a guild as the Don's Altosk and Oh. My. How pretty. Show it. So, a party in the streets every day, huh? This is gonna be great! Calm it down, Raven. These fireworks and skewers are a match made in heaven! Hey, I'll have one of those skewers too. Since when are you on vacation? <laughs> oh yeah, right. A minion's work is never done. You're the Dawn's messenger, so don't be rude to Bellius. Mm -hmm. Young man, you are looking at a veritable paragon of manners and good breeding. <laughs> No. Traveling in a group sounds like loads of fun. It's just a lot of noise. We've arrived safely, thanks to you all. Hey, you're Once welcome. I've unloaded my cargo. The Fiertia belongs to you, as promised. Thank you. Thanks. We'll take good care of her. So, are the sands of Kogor still a long way from here? They lie far to the west of Nordopolica. Aren't there some big mountains on the way there? That would make going by foot a problem. Wonder if we could get there by boat. Mm. I don't think that's possible. Oh, Not boy. many people go to the desert. I doubt there would be a place to moor a boat. Are you seriously going through with this? I told you the desert is really dangerous. Jeez, let her. I can't just let you go to a place like that all by your. I mean. Heading into port, me hearties. All right. Gosh, she's gorgeous. She's stunning. Both of these women, Judith and um. Uh, forgot her name. Redheaded girl. Karin Uzumaki, basically. <laughs> Karin. Karin's pretty cute, too. Not even gonna lie. Wow, this is beautiful, though. This is gorgeous. Good work. Thanks. Hey, you're welcome, no, no. Kaufman. Thank you. You're a huge help. Right. Mutual back scratching and all that. Oh, M Madam President, it's an honor to, to have you here. Mm hmm? Excavating more ruins? I'm always impressed that the guild boss himself supervises the excavations. That's the guild boss. The, the excavation of r ruins is w what I live for. Who's that? That's Regay, the head of Ruins Gate. Oh. Ruins Gate? That sounds familiar. They're the guild that's helping the Imperial Mages excavate ruins. <laughs> oh, that's why I've heard of them. Well, I have friends who are expecting me, so if you'll excuse me... That's fine. Be on your way. He seems like a nice person. He does. Hey, you were talking earlier about a guild that's selling Hoplone Blastia. You mean Leviathan's Claw? Do you think they might be getting their Blastia under the table from those Ruin guys? Ooh. Ruin's Gate is completely innocent. Oh, okay. How can you be so sure? They're upstanding, serious, diligent. That's what they're known for. Hmm. Huh. Well, I'm off. Take good care of the Fiertia. We will. Arrange for exchange of the Ceres Blastia and for transport of Tokenaga. Sure. Good luck, brave Vesperia. Thank you, Kaufman. Thanks! Mage is selling Blastia on the black market? That is so not good. I agree. Rita? Huh? Oh, yeah. 
All right. I guess I'll be going now. Oh, you're leaving, Patty? Going where? I've got lots of stuff to do. You mean treasure hunting? Hi. Thanks for all the help. Hey, not a problem. It was nothing. Thanks for piloting our ship, by the way. It's been real fun. Be careful out there. You too. You too. Well, I got some work to do myself. Oh. Oh yeah, your letter. It's for Bellius, right? Yep. Hey, why don't we all go? Good idea. She probably knows something about Pharaoh. We'll just tag along with you and say hi to Bellius. All right. I don't know if that's such a good idea. Of course, I, I've only heard rumors, but uh, hmm. But what is something wrong? Huh? Nah, it's nothing. Where can we find Bellius? The Colosseum, probably, since Bellius is the Duce of Polystrolin. All right. Patty left the party. At least Raven is still here. Just what sort of person is this Bellius exactly? Well, that's just it. I've heard the name often enough, but I've never met the person. Carol, do you know? I've only lived in Dongress, so I don't really know the guilds in Nordopolica. Mm. The last thing we need is another Dawn on our hands. <laughs> you can say that again. One Dawn is plenty. I can hardly wait to meet Bellius now. All right. Hello? Oh, you have something for me. Cribbins, G T Batangi too? Batangi? That's a type of fish, right? Is it any good? Nice to be as bad as brine soaked boot. You can eat it if you tried. But now it's rather tasty. Hmm. And she's off again. See, the fish used to taste bad, and now it's good. Aye, it was wee gamey fishy. But nay meat outlands. But it's got all nice fat all. Fat all of the sun. Makes the right brawl meat now. Brawl meal. This could have caused by the local air imbalance as well. That there's an air crane at the bottom of the ocean. Judy. Not. Again. It's terrible. Hurry. Yeah. What is a hubbubba boot? I don't know any details. Simply that a blasty has been destroyed. Who do a thing like that? One saw their face, but apparently it was someone wielding a spear. Uh, spear? It's a dragon freak. Do you not connect two and two? Oh, Rita. It is always running off to one place or another. Isn't that right, Judy? Judy? I think Judy is very much the same way, to be honest. Huh? I don't think that's true. Where were you? Yeah, a very nice gentleman invited me out to tea. What? Inconceivable. We don't need your commentary, old man. Seems like there's some commotion going on. Did something happen? A blast has been destroyed by the St. Dragon Rider as last time, too. Oh, how frightening. Yeah, I'll bet you're scared stiff. Just torn to pieces. Damn it. I swear I'm going to make a permanent imprint of my fist into that dragon freak's face. Oh, my lord. How is this going to be explained? Okay, uh... All right. Oh. Master! Oh, it's, um... Ah, Princess. Been a while. Are you in good health? Yes. Master, you look quite well yourself. Since you traveled to a great many places since last time we met. Yes. I've seen and heard so many things. It's been an amazing experience. But... Was that experience really necessary in order for you to take the Imperial Throne? What do you mean? You've been cover converting about with people of questionable character, without any regard to, to proper behavior or principles. Questionable character, huh? Have you given any thought to whether or not these have been the right actions for a candidate to the Imperial Throne? But Master... He said I needed to have a wide range of experience. There's nothing wrong with broadening your horizons. 
The problem is your own actions. My own actions? It's a question of whether or not you've been conducting yourself in a manner fitting of the sacred role of Empress. Like you to examine the actions that you yourself have taken since you left the castle. And consider whether or not those were truly the correct actions to take. Whoa. What a self-righteous old geezer. Did I notice that attitude last time we met him? Is he always like that? Yes. Master Drake has always been very... strict. I'm pretty used to it, though. But really? You might just be the reason that I'm traveling with you. I mean, I want to prove myself to him. That's just a guess, right? I'm sorry. Actually... No, it's fine. If you're just guessing, it's true that you want to prove yourself to him, right? Yes. Alright, then you should set him aside and give him a piece of your mind someday. Okay. Good. Alright. Let's continue. What? What monster? Night like tonight will foul one blown. What? Oh boy, that's foreshadowing. Okay, can't go anywhere else. Alright. Statue of Nick the Summon Trake was built as the goddess of victory for the arena. Okay. It's missing a head. Well, let's go into the Colosseum. In. Okay, that's the in. That's the. Uh. No, I'm fine then. Okay, let's see what you have for sale here. Alright, pork. Let's stock up on, stock up on that. And eggs. Perfect. All right, Raven and Yuri. Three. Oh, these are. Oh, I thought this was secondary weapons. All right, all right. You have that. You have that. You're learning this. And you're learning that as well. Alright, I think I should... Be oh, wow. We are out of orange gel completely. Wow. That went quick. Anything with TP just goes by quick. Alright, synthesis. Let's, I'm trying not to be like so overpowered. And this is the same. I do have a. Mm. Am I learning something that. Uh, I think I'm learning something. Well, that's quite a bit of things to. Yeah, but I do have almost everything, so... Anything here worth getting? A mysterious set sphere that improves your decision-making skills. Allows you to assign to another set of arts. Oh, yes, please. Alright, that's good. Alright, now... Hey, nothing fishy. Let's enter. Oh. Oh my god. Guess you found me. You're pretty good. I'll teach you to cook as a reward.
And then the recipe for kebab sand kebab sandwich. Give you this so you can practice. You said some ingredients. Thank you. Gotta go till we meet again. All right. Uh, oh, this is where we needed to go. Lord Bellius's private room is ahead. I cannot allow you to go any further. But we've come to see Bellius. What? Who are you? Brave Vesperia, but a messenger from the Dun. Brave Vesperia. I haven't heard of you. Do you have an appointment with the Duce? Huh? An appointment? Unfortunately, my lord only meets with individuals who have appointments. So that means we can't get in. How about a messenger from Don Whitehorse? The Don? Oh, my apologies. My name is Nats. I'm the acting representative for the Duce. Ah. I will gladly deliver any message you have for the Duce. Sorry, but the Don's orders were to give this letter directly to Bellius. Is that so? Unfortunately, Bellius only receives guests on the night of a new moon. Hmm. If you could perhaps come on the next new moon. And when is that? The next new moon? Why only on the night of a new moon? I guess that's just how she does things. People can be weird sometimes. The moon just turned full, so the new moon is still a while away. Oh boy. So should we come back? We don't really have a choice if she's not here. Yeah. Sorry for the trouble. I'll let her know that a messenger from the Don stopped by. Thank you. Great. We appreciate Thanks. that. So why don't we see what we can find out about the desert? And about Pharaoh, too. Might as well. I'd like to get some information about the air crene myself. We shouldn't have trouble getting information about all of that in a city this big. You mind if old Raven goes ahead to the inn? I should send off a progress report to the Don. Sure. All right, let's get going too. Let's go. Raven left the party. All right, let me equip because I bought some stuff. Oh, you still are uh, doing that, but uh, I do have the knight's armor. There we go. I should buy like the best things for Yuri. I'm going to do that. I am going to cheat. No, not cheat because that was given to me. I'm going to buy the best armor for Yuri because I do get thrown a lot in 1v like 50s. So let's do that. Full plate, Metro plate. Wow. Full plate is the best. Uh, sad days. Full plate would be kind of like the best I can give. Oh, better than nothing. Because everybody else has, like, the best. I did that for them, so might as well. Yeah, I got everything, like, the best of the best for everybody. Hmm, I should be fine. I should give him the... I can't, uh... Hmm. Alright. Well, he does have everything right now. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That's... That's just not fair. That's just really not fair. All right, but with that done, I think I'm going to leave things here. So, if you guys have been enjoying these videos as much as I have, please leave a like, comment, and share. That always helps out against that pesky YouTube algorithm. Subscribe to join the Moonlight Army today. Hit that bell icon to be notified when I upload a new video. If you guys want to stalk me on my social medias, the links will be in the description box below. And... I'll see you guys in the next video. So, take care guys. Bye-bye.